Hey everybody, we are going live. We've got two minutes to load up for this next workout. We're doing a fusion hit class today. So I welcome you all to get ready, clear some space, and get ready for the workout. So as we're loading in, I have a big favor to ask everybody. I have added music in a different way than usual today, and I need to know if you can hear me and if you can hear the music. So let me know. I'm looking for your response. Can you hear my, my verbal over the music? Is it good? Is it working? Colleen, Kaya, what do you think? Can you hear me? Let me know if you can't hear me because then I will turn down the music. But if not, I will use the music. All right, low. All right, Kaya says music is loud. Too loud? Bring it down. How's that? Can you hear me? Is the music better now? Can you hear my voice or no? I want to make sure that you can hear me before we get into this workout. All right. Dara says thumbs up. I got another good. Is it good right there? Awesome. So for this workout, all you need is your own body weight. That's it. If you have a mat, I have my mat out. Um, we're going to be using the mat. This is a 30-minute workout. We're going to warm it up. We're going to do a fitness yoga fusion of the workout. And then once we, I'm just turning down the volume just a little bit more. All right, once we are warmed up, we are going to do four, that be four, four sets of intervals. We're going to do about two, minute and a half of steady state work, strength work, and then a 30 second hip push for each workout. So we're going to do four squats, planks, lunges, and then core. And then you're done. All right, so what I'd like you to do is really hit the 30 second interval hard when you get there. So when we get to that 30 second interval, hit it hard, crush it, work yourself at your own tempo. Should we warm it up? I say yes, it's exactly 12 o'clock and we're gonna warm up. So a little bit of a fusion uh, yoga warm up as you go. So bring your feet about keep your shoulder width apart, right, so you find a comfortable stance. Let's connect the breath, inhale, raise up. Exhale, soften your knees and come down. Let's come up. Now let's get some movement into the legs and into the feet by just bending your knees and then extending up. Good, breathing through this. And this is going to be short, sweet, but intense. It's all about hitting it hard, yes? One more time. Come down all the way up. Inhale, raise up. Hands come behind your back. Interlace your fingers. Open up your chest and breathe. Then open it up through. Breathe through it. Bring the arms in front. Contract them around. Inhale, lift up. As you exhale, go to one side. Inhale, lift up. Exhale to the opposite side. Inhale, raise. Exhale, and roll the shoulders back. Let's take it out in front again. Tuck and round. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, hands back behind your back. Interlace your fingers, open up the chest and breathe. Release it, take a deep breath. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, go to the side. Inhale, lift up. Exhale to the opposite side. Inhale, raise, exhale, and release, and roll your shoulders. Did you notice that I'm wearing my Wonder Woman shirt today? I thought, it's appropriate. Come down into a squat, and then lift up. So just gentle, easy squats. Gentle, easy squats to warm up. Two more. We're going to do a lot of squats later, so don't get too tired here. Okay, take it down, hands to your thighs. Tuck the tailbone underneath right you, round out your back. And then inhale, create length through your spine. So we're rounding and tucking. Inhale, and up and Rounding and tucking. Inhale, lift. From here, let the chest melt down to the thighs. Fingertips come to the floor. Gently start to get the hips up so you get length. Hold into that forward bend. And then sit down and squat low. Lengthen. And squat low. Alright, we've got to get in. We've got to get the work done. And we've got to get out. Keep it going. Two more. One more. Good. And now come down, palms the hands down on the floor, step one foot back, the other foot back, come to a plank position. Soften the knees, top to the feet to the floor, plus back, child's pose. From child's pose, keep your weight forward, put your toes on and come to plank. Lift your hips up, drive back. Come forward into your plank, soften your knees, come back. Let's do that again. Curl under, lift, pipe up, come forward, soften the knees. And back. You've got two more of those on your own time. Shifting forward into a plank, planking it up into that downward facing dog. 
lowering it down, pressing back, and one more. Breathe through it. Yep, and back. Now take your right foot to the outside of your right hand, and then just open that hip, just releasing the hip a little bit, get some movement happening in that side of your body. Right, curl that back toe under, lift up, good, reach and rotate. So the back knee is lifted, we rotate, and rotate into that lunge. Breathe through it. Hand comes down, step back, downward facing dog. Breathe into it here. Inhale and exhale. Walk the feet out to roll from one foot to the other foot. Just rolling out. Walking it out, rolling out, get your legs ready. Good. One more time. Can you bring your knees down? Let's take it to the opposite side. Lunge forward. As you lunge forward, open that hip, pull back towards under, lift that back knee up. Right, hold it here and breathe. Now lift that arm up and rotate. And as you rotate, I'm going to open up to the chest and shoulders, breathing into it. Good, hand comes down. Step back, come into your downward facing dog. Walk to your feet. So you roll from one foot to the other foot. So rolling up from one foot to the other foot, keep it going. Rolling it, breathing through it. For four, three, two, one. Walk your feet into your hands. Exhale, fold over your legs. Let the tension go your neck and shoulders. Good to be roll up through your spine all the way up. Sweep your arms back, inhale. As you exhale, come down to that forward bend. Inhale, create length, bend your knees, hands to the floor, jump your step back to a plank. Lower yourself down into a push-up. Inhale, extend your spine. Exhale, soften the knees, push back, child's pose. Then come forward, come back into a plank, curl your toes under. Lift your hips up, downward facing dog. Oh yeah, the pace is picking up. Lift your heels, lift your hands, jump your step in. Exhale, fold over your legs. Inhale, raise all the way up. Exhale, come down, so that one more time. Then we're going to warm up. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, hip hinge forward, out of the sideways. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Bend your knees, jump or step back. Into your plank from here, lower all the way down. Inhale, come up to an extension. Exhale, lower, soften in your knees, push back, child pose. Come forward, curl your toes under. Come up to plank, lift your hips, downward facing dog. Bend your knees, step or jump in. Exhale, fold over your legs. Inhale, come over to standing. Exhale, bring it down. Walk it out, catch your breath. All right, heart rate up, warmed up. Are you ready to go? I'm checking in with you. You feeling ready? Okay, some more people just joined us. If you missed the warm up, just warm up a little bit because we're hitting the intervals right now. We're gonna go for about a minute and a half of work, steady state, then we go into a push, then we repeat it, yeah? Okay, so here we go. Bringing your feet about hip or shoulder apart. All right, finding your neutral squat position. Sit down into your squat. So the first part is all about steady state training. It's all about strength. It's about endurance. Find that endurance. Good. So you're going to take your right leg. You're going to step to the side. Then you're going to step back. Step to the side. Step back. Keep it going. Step to the side. Step back. Nice work, everybody. All right. Keep going. Keep it working. Can you hear me now? Some people are saying to speak maybe a little bit louder. Is it all right? All right, otherwise I can turn off the music. I'm not sure how to do that, but I'm gonna try. All right, keep it working forward, going back and side in those lunges. Two more, one more, then take it to the side and hold. Hold, three, two, one, and back. Three, two, one, and up. Three, two, one, and back. Three, two, one, you got it. Press, two, three, and back. Two, three, and down. Now, did I tell you we have two rounds of each of these? I maybe forgot to play that. Because we've got two legs, right? And up, one more time. Come here, pull, isometric pull. So just gonna shift between the legs, so one side to the other. Breathe in through it here. Nice and easy, good. Now, pulse three, two, one, stand up. Three, two, one, stand up. Okay, so we're coming into our first push. We're coming into our first push. Right now you should be feeling a little bit of muscle fatigue. Maybe not your maximum fatigue, but that's coming your way. Are you ready? Come down, hold. Hold here. Here's our 30 second push. Let me check it on the clock so I don't like give you too much time. All right, isometric hold, bring it through it. Now you've got a choice. You can walk, walk, out, out, or jump. Ready, five, four, three, two. Go in, go out, 
go in, go out, push it out. We've got this. It's only 30 seconds. Only 30 seconds. Remember, you can walk, walk, out, out. Walk, walk, out, out. Walk, walk. Heart rate should be up, breathing rate should be up. 10 seconds, my friends. 10 seconds. Stay with it. Yep. In five, four, three, two, one. Come up. Squat side, the other way. And back. Side. And back. So you should be trying to catch your breath right now. I am definitely trying to catch my breath. So we're going side and back. Your lateral lunge, right? When you go side, try and keep your hips square and equal weight into both legs. Mm -hmm. Now, this side, this glute, right there, should be starting to talk. Just talking loud. I don't leave when the breath's not back yet. Okay, come back. Pulse, two, three, out, two, three. Back, two, three, go. Yeah, you got this. Keep it going. Keep on that rhythm. Of course, I can't see what rhythm you're doing at home. But as long as you're doing a pulse, 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 and a push, push, push. Hey, Joelle. Good to see you. I've been watching your workouts online, too. All right, so check out the uh, Energy Lab because they're doing tons of great workouts online as well. So check it out. Read through it. Are you just about ready? Let's come outside hold. Three, two, one. Stand up. Three, two, one, stand up. Okay. Now you've done it once before, so you know you can do it again. All right, come down, hold. Get ready. You can walk in or jump in. You have got 30 seconds starting now. Go, boom, out, in. Ah, yes. Doesn't it feel good? They get your heart rate up. Now, we're probably in bare feet in our homes, so land softly. Land softly. Keep going. Push it. Keep it going, you've got 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Walk it out. Oh. Okay, that's your first round of exercises. Second one's all based on points. So you're going to give yourself a little room, right, so you can walk forward. Inhale and check. Exhale, get in. Walk yourself forward. Here we go. Cool. So, Hike up, hike down, take your right hand to your left shoulder, take it down, now walk it down, walk it up, walk it up, walk it down. So that's your sequence. Okay, so hike up, come to plank, left hand, right hand, left forearm, right forearm, up, up, hike it up. Do it again. Up, up, lower, lower. Now remember, you can adjust this by going onto your knees. So you find the T starts to happen, and you want to take it down. Feel free to take it to your knees. Right? Keep it going. Now you're on your own right now. Pike it. Don't forget to pike. Right? You want to find that strong pike. Find that rhythm. Oh, guess what time it almost is. Time to crush your heart rate again. All right, so finish two more rounds of this. Pike, plank, touch, touch, down, down, up, up. One more round of it. And then we're hitting it. Are you ready to hit it for 30 seconds? Ooh, five, four, three, two. Let's set it up. Right foot goes wide. You go back, left foot goes wide. You go back. Now we're going to turn sideways. We haven't started at 30 seconds yet, just so you know. This is preparation. Okay, so foot goes in. Now you can go switch, switch, switch. So ready, set. Let's hit it now. 30. Boom, boom, boom. Ha. Keep it going. Keep talking to yourself. Tell yourself, I am resilient. I am resilient. I can do this. We're just checking our time. You have got 10 seconds. And then we've got a second set of planks. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Woo! So good, right? 
Okay, second set of planks. Here we go. Come back to the plank. Find that strong plank. All right, from here, one push up and then rotate. A push up, a rotation. A push up, a rotation, plank hold. Lift your right leg, lower. Lift your left leg, lower. Okay, so that's the sequence. Here we go. One push up, reach up. Second push up, reach up. Hold your plank, lift, lower, lift, hold. Push up, go down, reach up, come down, reach up. One leg lift, up, lower, up, hold. Catch your breath, go down. Remember you can go to your knees, right? Coming at your knees just decreases that load a little bit. One leg up, one leg up, rest. Two more rounds on your own time. Push up, reach, push up, reach. Hold, one leg up, one leg up. One more time around. And then guess what we have? We have like 30 seconds of crushing. How's your heart rate? Hey, Shep, good for, for you for joining us. Come on in, let's make it happen. Ready, everybody? Three, two, one, rest. Okay, small break. All right, ready for 30 seconds? One foot out to the side. Remember, you can step back or you can jump back. Ready, set, 30 is on now. Go, boom, boom, out, out, boom. Keep it working. I just gotta check the time. Thank goodness I'm on the timing and not on the working. You're on the working. Let me keep you true to time. We've got 10 seconds left. Keep it going. We're gonna get a mini break here as we switch to the next set of exercises. In five, four, three, two, rest. Ah. How does that feel? I don't know about you. But I felt that. All right, roll yourself up. Step up. All right, here we go. Feet, hip or shoulder apart. Okay, rear lunge, front lunge. Okay, so rear lunge. You go back, you lower. You pass through, you come front. So we go back and front. Now, if you want to add a balance challenge, you're going to be up, lower. Lift, lower. Boom, back, up, back. So yes, we are doing fusion hits. You didn't think you could take yoga and Pilates and fitness and make it a hip workout, but you can. Who's loving it right now? Feeling it? Keep it going, everybody. My heart rate's up, my breathing rate's up. It's good, it feels good to sweat. Keep it up. Okay, we're gonna add the pulse. So we're gonna go back. Three, two, one. Front three, two, one. Boom. Three, two, one. If you want, add the arms. Three, two, one. Reach for it. Three. Two, one, reach for it. Three, two, one. Are you ready for your hit? It's coming in 10 seconds. And then we'll do the other leg. Ready? Finish it. Two, one. Okay, so left leg back. Left leg back. So we call this a pop switch. We go pop, switch, pop, switch. Pop it up, switch it, pop it up. Switch it, let's go. 30 seconds. You go at your own time. Pop, switch. Pop it, switch it, pop it, switch it. I'm on the time, don't you worry. You have 10 seconds left. Heart rate is pumping, yes? Five, four, three, two, one. Small break. Opposite leg back. Rear lunge, find your balance, pass through forward. So this is where we catch our breath. Active recovery as we move into strength. Now you can add that knee balance as you go through. Your tempo is your tempo. You don't have to be the same tempo as I am. But you're passing through the center, stepping front, stepping back. Right? So it's that lifting, lowering. And the depth of your lunge is really what feels good for you. What feels good for you as you go through this? Yeah, are you ready for the pulse? I'm still breathing heavy. Okay, everybody, let's go back. Three, two, one, lift. 
front and back. So you've got three pulses at the bottom. You lift up, you come down. Two, three, you lift up. Use your arms to help you get that lift. Up, down, two, three. Okay, in five seconds, comfort zone is done. We are going into that 30 second push. Are you ready? I'm gonna show it sideways so you can see. Three, two, one. Pop, switch, pop, switch, pop it up, switch, pop it up, switch, pop it up, switch. Yes, you can do this. 15 seconds to go, 15 seconds to go. Almost done it. Keep it going. I found hard. Are you feeling it? Find your heart, find your heart. You're almost done. Five, four, three, two, one, walk it out. Okay, catch your breath a little bit because we're gonna take it down to the floor. Now, just because we're on the floor does not mean this is gonna get any easier than it has been. But we're gonna do a core set. Remember, we've got about a minute and a half, and then 30 seconds, and then another minute and a half, 30 seconds, and then you are done. How good is that, right? It's flying by for me. All right, so let's come to the top of the mat. Inhale, come up. Exhale, hip hinge. Bend your knees, jump your step back. Plank pose. Lower yourself all the way or halfway. Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, back downward facing dog. Better. Lift your heels, bend your knees, jump in. Exhale, fold. Press down to the feet, inhale, raise up. Exhale, try and calm your heart rate. Breathe. We're gonna do that two more times. You've got your tempo. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, hinge. Inhale, lengthen, bend your knees, jump or step back. Lower yourself down. Inhale, open. Exhale, go back. Breathe and hold. Lift your heels, bend your knees, jump or step in. Exhale, over your legs. Push down to your feet, inhale, raise up. Exhale, and come down. One more time through. Inhale, raise up. Exhale. So we're trying to get a hold of our breath here. Trying to get control. Come down. Lower down. Inhale. Exhale. Hold. Breathe. Then lift your heels, bend your knees. Jump in, cross your ankles, and sit down. Woo! All right, final set. Final set. I'm going to turn sideways so you can see what's going on. Okay, right, so you keep your eyes in tune with what's happening. Let's stretch out the back first. Roll it up. Okay, roll back. All the way. Reach out over here. Okay. So now, you're going to straighten your right leg. You're going to bend your left leg. And all we're going to do is curl straight up. So you're going to curl, 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 and reach up. And then curl back. All right, so on your own time. If you need support on the way up, you're going to take a hold of this leg. Right, so that bent knee is there for, for help. So it's gonna help you. I don't know how much it's gonna help you, but it's there to help you. Okay. I'm gonna face forward so you can see what's happening next. Okay, here we go. You're gonna curl up. Your right arm goes up, you look back, and then you go back. You're gonna curl up, your right arm goes up, and then you go back. Okay? So now we're gonna add a lift. Now you may say, you know what, I'm not gonna lift. I have no idea what we're talking about, but if you'd like, you're gonna come up, you're gonna lift, you're gonna go to that side T, you're gonna come back, and you're gonna go back. Yep, you're gonna go up, you're gonna go to the side T, you're gonna come in, you're gonna go back. There it is, my friends. Keep it going. You find your rhythm, you find your tempo. Good. What's the hard part? One of the hard parts, don't worry about that right now. It's still coming. It's still coming. Mm -hmm. Are you ready for it? Four, three, two. We're going to go slow motion first. I'm going to go the way you were going so that you can see this. Turkish get ups. That's your hard part. Okay, so you're going to roll up. You're going to roll up. Up. Right? You're going to bend the knee. You're going to come through into a new position. You're going to come up. You're going to stand up. You're going to go back down. Hand goes down, the leg flips through. So now the left leg is forward, and you roll back. So you come up, you come in, you come up, you stand up. Now start to pick up your temple. Hand goes back, thread it through. 
go down. Up. So this is a full body motion. Now the arm that's overhead, trying to keep it vertical. What did you say? Yes. I need you to go in there, buddy. We got a little bit more time in here. Coming down. Hand goes down. Leg threads through. You come down. Let's do one more rep. Up. Thread. Lift. Stand. Take it down. Down. Hand down. Thread. Sit down. Okay. Other side. Left leg stays where it is. Right leg bends in. We just curl up. Really good one. So you curl it up. You curl it down. Now try and use control. So you're not throwing your arms overhead. You're using your core to roll yourself up. Now I can see people doing this with momentum. Okay. Momentum is your friend. But I don't want your momentum to take away from your workout. Right, so now come up. Right? You're gonna rotate next time. You come up, you rotate, you go back. Up, rotate, and back. Now you know where you're gonna go next, right? You can choose to stay with this. Or you go up, you pick it up. Now that puts you back where you can step it out, your choice, and then go back. Right? And then do it the way you're doing it, just so it makes sense. Right. Different angles, different perspectives. Right? And here you go. Nice technique. Now go slow. If you want to go slower, slow does not mean easier. Definitely not. If you slow it down, you might actually get more work out of it. So keep it up because we've got Turkish get ups on the other side. One more time. Good. And down. Okay. So your left leg is straight, left switch. Okay, so I'm going to go slow motion first. You're going to hear it, see it from the side now. You're going to roll up, right? You're going to bend through. Stand up and get up. Right, so leg comes down. Right, you thread the leg through. You lower down and you go back. So lift. So it's the opposite arm to leg. You thread it through. You stand up. Go down. Hand back. Thread through. Hip goes down and you go back. You go in your own rhythm. Stand up. I think of this as ideal functional training because in life we've got to be able to get up and we've got to be able to get down. Right? Gracefully, of course. In full grace as you go through it. How many more repetitions? I think I forgot to look at the clock. Two more repetitions. How about that? Two more. And that will take you to the end of this. Are you almost there? One more, one more. Good. And then finish, seated, and down. Oh. Take your legs out in front. Oh. Catch your breath. Inhale, exhale, curve your spine. Inhale, lift and lengthen, exhale, curve your spine. So, in 20 minutes, you are able to accomplish a lot, yes or no? Yes? I see smiling faces coming up, thank you. Lift up, exhale, curl back. Inhale with the legs, or stretch the legs out long. Exhale, come forward with that forward bend. But let's not stay here too long, roll yourself up. Your heart rate is still high, so inhale, lift up. Exhale, forward bend. Roll yourself up. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, roll up. Ah, oh, come on, roll up. Exhale, and release. Let's come around onto your knees. Good. And in a knee position, just move your ribs and hips side to side. Just get some movement in your body. Again, still catching your breath. So catching your breath. Whoo wee. So a little more yoga here. Spread your hands, curl your toes under, downward facing dog. Don't stay there long. Come forward, use your plank. Lower yourself down. Forearms to floor. Inhale, come into an extension of the spine. Exhale and slow you down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, release. 
Inhale, lift. Exhale, release. This time, inhale, come up. And if you'd like, you can just stay here. Keep the feet pressing down. One hand behind your back. Other hand, interlace your fingers, open your chest and breathe. Release your hands, hands to the floor, soften your knees, push up, press back, and rest. Breathe into it here. Look so. Walk both hands over to the right. Reach that left arm over, then you stretch. Slightly shift your hips to the left so you get that nice stretch in the side body. Then increase that back and swing the other way. So that was a fusion hip class, yeah? See, you can take Pilates and yoga and fitness and blend them together and give yourself a good solid hit with good control of exercises as well. Mobility, stability, and strength. Then we'll come back to the center, come to a plank. Throw your toes under. Pike up with your belly, this and dog. Bend your knees, jump or step in, exhale, forward, forward. Let that tension go up your neck and your shoulders. You push down through your feet and then take a nice deep breath, inhale all the way up. Exhale, let the arms go down. Take your right arm, reach it up, left arm, reach it down, find that length inside of your body. Now really press into your right foot. Anchor that right foot down and then come up the other side. Anchor into the opposite side. I'm, I'm dripping sweat into my eyes right now, so I'm blinking at you. Anybody else drip a little bit of sweat? <laughs> and come up, take a deep breath, inhale, raise up. Exhale, soften and come down. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, soften and come down and shake it out. Nice work, my friends. Nice work. Did you get a good solid workout a short period of time? Got it done? All right, tomorrow morning I'm back on at nine o'clock. It's a surprise workout, so just join me at nine o'clock tomorrow morning. Have a wonderful day. See you next workout.